Hey guys, this is Carmen, and today on Try This With Me, um, I'll be shaping my nails for the first time in the almond style shape. Alright, so the video I watched on how to shape almond nails, first thing they told me to do was to draw a dot in the middle, and I don't know if you could tell, but there was already a dot, so then you draw from the like pink part of your nail bed to that dot right in the middle, and if you need help, it said to like draw a line down the middle of your um, nail to see so that you would know where the middle part is. So that's what I'm doing on my hand here. So having almond nails has kind of been a like I guess dream daydream of mine. Um, not like a serious dream or anything, but like a wish, a wish of mine um, for a couple years, months now. I just figure like you always need really really long nails so for the past couple months I've been growing them out. They got to about, I want to say like three quarters of a centimeter. I can't measure you guys. Something like that. Before I got to the point where I was like okay I'm ready to shape them now. And then the reason I did it the day that I did do it is because uh, actually one of my nails broke. So if you notice um, on my right hand, um, the ring finger is like a little bit shorter than all the rest of them and that's why my ring finger broke and that's another reason why it's not as pointy as the rest of them. Then the tutorial told me to get out my nail file so I bought this nail file. And they said to use a glass one, but I don't have money for a glass one, nor was it in the drugstore. And I didn't, honestly, I don't really use nail files. So I have these two uh, nail files. The floral one I just bought because I feel like the one that I have originally isn't very sandpapery enough. I mean, you know, it's not, not like strong, I guess, enough to do. So I bought this floral one. It did pretty well, I think. Um, it shaped the nails pretty well. It was just like running out of steam at the end, so I used the one that I already had to finish up the rest. Um, so here I am, you just shave off until like about the like angle part. And then at the end, you kind of like shape it so it's not just pointy. So here I am just shaping them. And just fast forward through that. Uh, they got really pointy, and which is what I liked, but they weren't like too pointy, still little like. So then I took off my nail polish that I was wearing and the Sharpie that I used. And then I just painted my nails, so this is what it looks like. It has been a week now and they last really well. They're just much sharper than I'm used to, but otherwise typing and all daily activities has been great. And that's all for this Try This With Me. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed it. Bye!